Good, good day, day internet, internet people. people. We've got Mr. Jack here with his Gear Chronicle deck yeah, for you to have a little look at. Sure okay, so let's get into it. Yeah. For starter, I run a TikTok worker. Okay. It's a nice little card. Um, its skill is uh, when when a unit when a rear guard has attacked, uh, you can pop it into the soul and time loop that unit. Uh, if you don't know what time loop is, it's a uh, you put put a unit into your bind zone and then uh, call a grade higher. <laughs> That's the main strategy in this deck. Uh, pretty much, yeah. yeah. It was a. There is still essence of a rewinding. They're going to use the bomb deck, but it is mostly focused on a time loop now. It gets you a big combo attack, basically. Yeah, so that's a little combo yeah. in this deck. Yeah. Uh, so that's the starter. Yeah. Uh, for triggers, I run uh, four crit. Uh, this is meant to be a uh, double rare one, but I could not for the life of me find it. <laughs> Uh, his skill is a. Uh, so he's proxying basically. Yeah, pretty much. Um, his skill is a. Uh, if you have a Chrono Jet and Vanguard, when your Vanguard attacks, uh, pop him into the soul. Oh, no. Plus 5k and uh, draw a card. Simple. Double hail. Uh, 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 so I want to draw two. I would have used Commander 1. Four draw triggers. Draw triggers, yeah. Good, good card to go in the soul as well. Uh, yep, yeah, going plus 3. Put into soul plus 3. Pretty simple. And then uh, possibly one of the most important cards in the deck. Uh, Phil has uh, experienced what this card can do. Um, its skill is um, when you timely hit, uh, you can set to the bottom of your deck, you can draw two cards and place one back to the deck. It is. It may yeah, not sound that good at the start, but once you really realise that, you, once you uh, explain the combo, you'll realise how good it is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think you used it about three times in that one turn. Uh, about maybe four, three times. Yeah, so it's pretty funny. You can get about eight attacks off, so yeah. you know, And then uh, four heals. Oh yes. Uh, I'm using this heal because it looks a lot nicer. She's very pretty. She's got some sleeves in Japan now of her. Oh, nice. Oh uh, yeah, it just looks not not not, not nice. Yeah. I like the spike with this one. That's the best yeah. one. So sexy. All right, for grade ones then. I run three. Of possibly my favorite grade one in Gear Chronicle. Again, she's very good. Yep. Uh, her skill is, uh, her name is Steam Maiden Maelim and her skill is a uh, GB1, uh, when this unit attacks a vanguard you may give it plus 4k, uh, just pop it if you can see, I, I don't know, um, you give it plus 4k, but if you give it plus 4k you must return it to the bottom of your deck at the end of, at the end of that turn when the unit attacks, and then you call out a grade 0, aka. Is that you may call a grade 0 or you have to? Yeah, you have to call a grade 0, okay. mostly this guy. Uh -huh. So shenanigans. Oh yes, because if you've got Chrono Jet and you haven't attacked yet, you can also have just a crit there and then put it behind. Yeah, you put it into the soul, yeah, exactly. power, draw the card. <laughs> yeah, but it's mostly for this guy because you can't get a lot of hand It depends advantage. on what your combos are going like at the time, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, for the second, I run three time break dragon. Yeah, that's another newish one, isn't it? Uh, he was from the new trial deck. Yeah. yeah. Uh, his skill is GB1. When this unit is placed on rear guard, uh, you time leap a unit. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Yep. Pretty good. So if you time leap someone into him, then you could then time leap another thing and. Uh, uh, no, it has to be from hand. You can't. Oh, okay. You can't like place it from the deck. That's it's very specific on the wording. Though. It would be pretty broken if that was happening. Yeah. Uh, it wouldn't surprise me though. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, three drop the stride. Yeah. Steam breath. Good, good choice. Yep. So pretty simple there. And it fixes your grid three if you haven't got Chrono yep. And then uh, two from a uh, GBTO six as we're performing on uh, Sneak Peek Week. Mm -hmm. uh, this is to help those. Who, this is to go against people who like staying on grade twos, aka David. Mm -hmm. um, I, I haven't really used this card yet, but like it's just because it's Gear Chronicle. Gear Chronicle is mostly a GB deck. Mm -hmm. so, it just covers you against people who stall out too yeah. much, doesn't it? So, yeah. nice little uh, card there. And then uh, one GG. Yeah. You only need to run. You only need to run one of those. Uh, You're soul not going to soul charge that much, really, are you? Uh, no, the deck does soul charge a lot, but yeah, I only tend to use GG once because uh, okay. yeah, because this deck does actually deck out quite fast. At times. Uh, late, late game, it can deck out yeah. quite fast. She's a good staple in many decks. Yeah. Yeah. In really but early skill, game, so. getting to your hand, simple. Yeah. Soul blast two draw. Mm -hmm. And then four of the perfect guard G's. Because I'm putting. Yeah, you want that. It's very good. Yep. So you don't run Meshi? Uh, no. no. 
Because uh, I do oh, yeah. use the for GG, yeah. as you can see. Yeah. Uh, so, grade twos. I run four History Maker Dragon. Oh, yes, he's another trial deck card, isn't he? Uh, yeah. Uh, this is pretty much to replace the Amber from the. The when it's boosted. Yeah. This guy doesn't need a boost, does he? Uh, no, just when so it attacks. That's really good. Yep. So, uh, skill of Counter Boss 1, uh, when it's unit attacks Vanguard, Counter Boss 1, time with the unit. It's actually really, really good. Yeah. <laughs> Especially in a combo with um, Melee and uh, the Sand Trigger. Mm -hmm. So, it's very good. Uh, three upstream dragons are next. This is pretty much the Grey 2 version of a uh, melee. Uh, where is it? Plus four of them when it da, 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 da. Yeah. Yeah. That, But instead of calling grade zero, you call it grade one at rest. Okay. So if your damn got your maleans out, use this. Or you can call it Gigi. Yeah, GG. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> However you want to work it. <laughs> and then two uh, Clock Fencer Dragon. Yeah. It's pretty much the grade two version of a Time Break. So that's a triple there, is it? Uh, yeah, I don't know why that was a triple. Nice okay. Wait, you thought uh, anyway, yeah. So place on rear guard. From exactly. hand. From hand, yeah. Place on rear guard from hand. Time to unit. And now the great three. Obviously the MPV of the deck. The obvious choice. Chrono Jet Dragon. Ooh, signed. Yes. You pretty much have to run Chrono Jet Dragon, otherwise. Yeah, you can't really run a decent game Chronicle deck without it, really. No. So, who's your backup grid for me? Everyone knows what that yeah, does, I think. Everyone, so. knows, everyone knows Chrono Jet. Yeah. And then, uh, four, uh, Steam Fighter Ballet or something. Yeah, yeah, uh, Ballet. <laughs> yeah, he's a rare, he's a rare from a GB204. <laughs> and his skill is, um, is a, his GB1 skill is. Uh, when this unit attack hits a vanguard, cat plus one and send a unit, time leap a unit, and uh, rewind a unit, sorry, uh, of your opponent's units to the, back, to the bottom of the deck. But the main skill is uh, the bottom of the bottom, which is a uh, uh, cat plus one. When your G unit is stride uh, on top of this unit, uh, search your deck for a Chrono Jet Dragon, add, put it as your heart, and send this unit to the bottom of your deck and shuffle. So, again, it ensures you've got the right grid yeah. for you. And technically, I am running. Eight chrono jet dragons here. So. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yep. So that's nice the skill. yeah, that's the main deck out of the way. Mm -hmm. uh, strides now. Uh, I run two Metallica Phoenix. Uh, this is from the new trial deck. It's a very good unit. Uh, skill is when this unit attacks. If you have a chrono jet heart. Uh, you made uh, Persona flip, or flip over any G unit, G unit in your G zone, and time leap a unit. So it's very nice, it does help with the combo with um, Melee and History Makeup. So it's a very good card. Uh, one Chronos Command. I pretty much just uh, use this for Metallica Phoenix, but if I do have to use him, he's there. To he's still a solid card. Yeah. Put pressure on your opponent, if it hits, send all, your, send all their units to the bottom of the deck. Yeah. Nice. Uh, one Fiery March Colossus, again for Metallica Phoenix, but like I said, like, he's a nice little card, I hardly ever use him, but he's there. Uh, Cast plus one, send a unit to the bottom, send all your opponent's units to the bottom of the deck, and they can't go for that grade, so... Nice. In my opinion, that should have been a triple round. The set five, mm -hmm. and then uh, the most important stride of the deck. Uh, a lot of people don't like this one now, but I still think it's a very good card for Ragnarok Dragon. Ah, so you don't run next stage then? Uh, I would run next stage, but I can't get it. <laughs> ah, okay. Too expensive. Uh -huh. But look at this, that guy you pulled on camera before. Yep, this this one. Yes, <laughs> he's always been there. Yeah. Still a very solid card because it makes it hard for your opponent to deal with. Yeah. If, you have, if your opponent hasn't got a perfect guard, I know I'm no, no. like four or five damage, they're gonna, not going to have a nice day. Yeah. yeah. It's like your equivalent of your Saint Blair or your Messiah. Yeah. It's that big push for turn, I'm yeah. going to kill you now job, isn't it? Yep. <coughs> uh, the amount of times I, I've just... Uh, I think last week or so, uh, I was in a match against a Bermuda deck, mm -hmm. and it was like a minute minute away from uh, the match ending. Yeah. And I just strode into Ragnarok. I had a massive hand, but it, it was all grade zero, so they couldn't yeah. use it to the yard. 
dinner. Yeah, so, I mean, you never know what's in your pen at hand, and it's worth a gamble when you've got something like that, isn't it? Yeah. So, so that's my Beer Chronicle deck. Yeah, so what do you think, people? Have you got any suggestions, or do you think it's really cool? Are you going to build this deck yourself? Post down below with what you reckon. Down there, post down there, yeah, yeah. And uh, let us know what you think. And, yeah. Right, thanks Jack. for watching, Internet Sorry, people. Bye. And thanks to Mr. Jack. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.